Sweetie. That was quite the entrance. Mm. Let me come in some triage that I tap in, make an impression. Yeah, you sure did. It was good, but next time I prefer my nurses to be fully orientated before they're on the floor. Ouch. I haven't got any trouble with the big boss. Nope, I did that all on my own. Hello. No, he can't watch anymore. Villette will always try to push his luck, OK? Just tell him now that I said no. Bloody hell. Trouble at home. The babysitter doesn't have the willpower to deny my son his favourite programme. What? <clears throat> Just one extra half an hour, OK? But that is it. OK, catch you soon. Right, let's get you properly orientated. Nicole, this young man has fallen from a tree and sustained an ankle injury. Trial by fire. Fast and furious. Just the way I like it. Hang on, mate. Right, my name is Will. And that is the grand tour. I consider myself orientated. Yeah, but back to front, sorry. You were great jumping in back there, thank you. I'm not sure Dr. Whitley was so impressed. Her beef is with me, not with you, don't worry. Got that. Oh, you don't need to get into it. Workplace differences happen everywhere. Hey, um, I've been thinking we should maybe sell the batch, put it into cryptocurrency or buy a lifestyle block or... I can't see you doing either of those things. I can rock a gumboot with the best of them. Cryptocurrency? If Damo can do it, I can do it. What is this about? I don't know. It's just with Kylie and everything. I think maybe we need to change, shake things up. Oh, um, Drew, uh, Maeve. Oh, this is Maeve, our new nurse. Ah, Kylie's replacement. Suppose so. I'm sure. PSC surgeon and husband to this one. Mm. Hope she didn't crack the whip too hard. Don't mind a bit of a spanking. <laughs> um, okay. <laughs> nice. We'll, we'll see you around. Bye. A lifestyle block. Cryptocurrency. Ah, oh, the surgeon's wage. Yeah, don't get me started. Harper's my best friend. He was my. He is. I don't know. We're going through the thing. Ah. My best friend fights are the absolute worst. Yeah, really are. Sorry, geez, I shouldn't be offloading this on you. You haven't offloaded anything yet. I just didn't um, realise how much it was getting to me. Well, like I said, best friend fights suck ass. You want to drown your sorrows? Chew my ear off. You're my son's with his other mum, so I got all the time in the world. <laughs> Babysitter's got another dower. Mm hmm come on. My shop. I'm allowed to be worried. So good having someone who understands how hard it is doing it on your own. <laughs> Tell me about Wilder. He's amazing. Well, he was. He's starting to show the signs of a teenager, but I think we're OK for now. Oh, my <laughs> God. I'm dreading that with Billy. Well, you'll be great. Sounds like you have it all together. Doesn't feel like it. <laughs> I am currently sleeping on my mother's best friend's sofa. How'd that happen? Barely a bit Harper's baby. OK. Yeah, um, I didn't believe that he'd do something like that. Harper grabbed him, I yelled at her, and then he bit me. Bollocks. Yeah, it's all my fault. Lives are all over the place at the moment, and Barely's bearing the brunt of it all. His dad left, and then I was outpriced out of our flat, and so we were staying with Harper and Drew. Sounds like a best friend thing to do. It, yeah, and they were lovely, but um, it was actually just awful. Um, they bought my old home when my ex-husband lost all of our money. Jesus. Yeah, so just um, just being there, you know, with nowhere else to go, and just watching them live in my home, spending money that I can't even dream about, being all loved up when I'm throwing myself at Marty, and he's not even over his dead wife. Bit of much. <laughs> well, it sounds like you've been dealing with a lot. Zara, this is Maeve, the new nurse practitioner. Pleased to meet you. Thank you for freeing up the budget for her. She's already proven she's worth her weight in gold. <laughs> well, I'm glad some people can see that I'm trying to do my best. Welcome. You're in great hands. So it seems. Another round. Let's do it. Nicole, uh, I thought hiring Maeve was supposed to make my life easier. Sorry? Somehow we're understaffed in ED again. What? How? Uh, that might be my fault. I asked Sarah, is it, to help me with the, um, the tricky cast. Right, so you pulled one of my nurses in. One of my nurses? Yeah, well, she offered to give me a hand, so I jumped on it. I'm happy to come and be an extra pair of hands to help with the backlog. That's not really the that point. That would be great. Thank you, Maeve. So that's a yes to me in ED? 
Yes. Thanks. Just doing my job. Look, if she gives you any grief, just come and see me. Yeah. Sorry, um, things are a bit awkward between me and Nicole. Oh, it's okay. No, things are tense between you. Oh. Well, she just mentioned you are going through a time, nothing much. Right. Well, uh, you are a genius at clearing patients. Ah, my forte. <laughs> if there's not an emergency, why are you in the emergency department? It's a good question. The problem is with the ambulance at the bottom of the cliff, so to speak. You know, we need to get to them before they've wasted ED time. It's logical. Mm. Hey, how's ED looking now that you've had an extra pair of hands? Uh, it's great, thanks. Yeah, Maeve here is a whiz. Oh, that's why she was hired. Um, are you free for lunch? I thought I could show you around some of the local lunch spots. Oh, uh, wait, Harper and I are actually doing lunch. Oh, yeah, right, of course. You want to come? You're welcome, right? Yeah, 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 of course. I'm all the merrier. No, no, I'll leave you guys to it. You sure? Yeah, of course. Have fun. ED is rammed. Oh, you two were lunching. We've been managing the overflow. Sorry, I didn't realise there was uh, a... Everyone's entitled to a break, Nicole. Right. Maeve, I need you to head to ED. Oh, we're in a rush, Maeve. All okay? Yeah, it's just it might be easier if we move I know that you're an experienced nurse, but I am DON. You know, I understand that. if you have any protocol changes you wish to make, including switching staff, it needs to be run by me. <laughs> Got it. What? They're all gone. No, not me. It's your fab new import. Maeve? Mary Poppins and Scrubs turns chaos into sugar lumps. For God's sake. She's got us redirecting all the minor injuries. To where central? Their GP. If it's not an emergency, that out. You are kidding me. Well, it's working. As far as I can see, there's practically an echo. She thinks she is. I'm D-O-N. Harper endorsed it. Right, that's it. Maeve, can I have a word? Oh, uh, yeah, just now. this. Is everything okay? No, everything is not okay. Maeve ignored me. I can explain. When that. I explicitly told you to run any changes and establish protocol by me first. Okay, look, I'll just update you. Oh, you'll update me? On, on what? How you're running things now? No, I just thought something less public. Don't you lecture me on appropriate behaviour? Okay. And you stay out of it. I don't appreciate you going behind my back. But Maeve has some good initiatives. I thought we could use them. It is not good enough. Whatever problems you have with authority, we are sorting them right now. I won't be spoken to like that. Excuse me? No, look, whatever jealousy best friend issues you two have, leave me the hell out of it. What? I spoke to you in confidence. No, I like you, Nicole. But you have some personal issues that you're letting get in the way don't of your you job. Don't you dare speak to me! You're going through a hard time, it's obvious. But if you don't sort out your insecurities, you're going to be miserable and bitter for the rest of your life. Now, if you don't mind, I've got work to do. Dawn 